Half a dozen carjackings, attempted robberies, and a home invasion within weeks of each other. Hillview is dealing with a sudden uptick in violent crime. WLKY's Lauren Adams went to Bullitt County to talk with police to see what's behind the recent crime surge and what's being done to stop it. People held at gunpoint and forced to hand over their keys. It's happening not far from I-65 in Hillview at hotel parking lots and gas stations, even outside this business. Now Chief of Police William Mahoney has ordered his officers to step up patrols. I want them to be uh, aggressive and proactive in addressing this issue. He says up until recently, Hillview had never had a carjacking. Over the last few months, they've had seven. The first one surprised me. And the second one uh, surprised me even more. And then we started seeing a trend. Detective Chris Boone is working alongside the FBI and LMPD to solve this rash of crimes. It's a problem that's plagued Hillview for months. In March, a car stolen out of Louisville had been driven through the front doors of the Bullock County Pawn Shop on Marketplace Drive. One gun was taken. Then in August, a car stolen from this Holiday Inn was later involved in a Louisville chase ending with three juveniles arrested and guns being seized. And a car taken from this Hampton Inn two weeks later was connected to a shooting in Louisville, again involving kids under 18. Boone says Hillview's carjackings involve a troubling trend. Multiple groups of young kids from Louisville armed with guns and not afraid to use them. And things did get violent with a recent home invasion. Police tell me the victim and he was only targeted because he was outside sitting on his front porch. Well, he tried fighting back and he was shot by the group two times. They are getting more and more brazen. It's why Detective Boone is reminding people to pay attention to their surroundings while at the pump getting gas or even walking through a neighborhood where two people were targeted in September. He says every single victim has been distracted. If you see somebody that seems to be staring at you, you need to pay attention to that because they're probably watching you to try to find a good time to try to take your car from you. But the chief says he is determined to keep working these cases and making arrests. We're not going to stop trying. I mean, we're going to be, again, proactive and aggressive, and this is going to stop in our city. In Bullitt County, Lauren Adams, WLKY News.